Hi everybody and welcome to my YouTube page. It's been another week. Today we're going to be focusing on cleaning your cat's teeth because your cat's teeth also get plaque and can also get diseases just like a human or a dog. And so today we're going to be cleaning her teeth. Now since she's on dry cat food, I only have to do this about once every six months. Now if your cat is on wet cat food, I would suggest you check their teeth every month because the hard cat food, which is dry, takes off plaque for the most part and you only have to clean their teeth maybe once every six months or so, sometimes less. Alright, and now we're going to get started. Say hi Lily! You don't need one of these lamps. It's pretty much just to give in some extra light, though it does help, I'm not going to lie. As you can see, her teeth aren't really bad right here. It's just a little bit of plaque, not bad. Now it's okay if your cat's or dog's teeth bleed just a little bit where the gums are, because obviously you can't get everything. And you just simply do this. They much prefer dental tools over, say, a dime or a quarter, like some people prefer to use. I found that uh, they don't particularly enjoy that. It's okay, Lily. She actually does a lot better with this than she does with them. Um, with quarters or other things. And you just simply clean them a little bit. Alright, well, uh, Miss Lily here decided that she didn't want to cooperate. So when your cat or dog does not want to cooperate, the best thing to do is just kind of put them in a blanket or a towel and then this somewhat calms them down. As you can see, I'm getting the plaque. from her teeth and she's a bit calmer now that she can't just uh, squirm it's best to try and get underneath the gums cause plaque does particularly enjoy resting there And that's why you put them in a towel, especially if they're not declawed. Because I'm not hurting her at all. She just doesn't particularly enjoy having something pulling on her teeth. And now you see that plaque that's right there? Right in the corner, right here. That's all plaque. 
I'm just gonna take a toothbrush, which is right here, and I got it from Walmart. It's just a little pet toothbrush that works, though so a regular toothbrush, um, child's size will work just fine too. And it just makes it so that the plaque that you scraped off doesn't get back into their mouth because that's not quite healthy for them. Obviously or wise, I wouldn't be doing this. Now, I'm not going to record this whole thing, just for the fact that Millie doesn't particularly enjoy having a camera in her face. So, I will show you the aftermath when I'm finished. But for now, we're just going to say goodbye for now, and we'll show you the aftermath. Alright, well we're finished with Lily's teeth now. As you can see, there's no plaque. It's just white teeth. And then... Well, she ended up kind of biting her cheek there, but... That's all clean. Just gotta wait for it to stop bleeding. But this side was more dirty. Cause I don't know why, but that side normally is dirtier. And all the other parts of her teeth are clean. The towel trick really does work. And now Lily is really happy. And that's the end of this video. Toodles!